Illinois' primary election day now just under a month away. In the heated race for the 7th Congressional District, campaigns are ramping up their rhetoric before voters make their final choice. And WGN political reporter Taman Bradley is here with more on that tonight. Taman. Ray and Micah, good evening. Danny Davis, West Side congressman for almost 30 years, could be in for the re-election fight of his life. He's got an opponent with high name ID and a challenger who almost beat him two years ago. But his opponents are facing increased scrutiny. And this matters. And this matters. Okay. Today, a group called the Women Won't Be Silenced Coalition launched a blistering attack on Democratic candidate for Congress, Melissa Conyers Irvin. We have to stand our ground that you cannot continue to misuse black women in the, in the marketplace, in the business arena, and any other way. At issue, a finding by the Chicago Board of Ethics that Conyers Irvin, the city treasurer, violated ethics rules by firing two staffers who alleged she pressured public employees to help political allies. Although Conyers Irvin could face a fine, she doesn't want to talk about the controversy. Last week, she dodged our questions on the topic. Have you ever threatened to retaliate against employees who raise concerns about your, your conduct? We've issued that statement. We've had several interviews. In this 7th Congressional District, this race, I am focusing on what matters to working families. Conyers Irvin is one of four Democrats challenging 14-term Congressman Danny Davis. When you got high water and you're trying to get across the river, you don't change horses in the middle of the stream. Backed by the powerful Chicago Teachers Union, Conyers Irvin is telling voters it's time for Davis to pass the torch. It is time for someone with new ideas and energy to go to Washington, D.C. and work on our behalf. It's time. I am the only working mother in this race that understands the challenges of working families. As Conyers Irvin makes the rounds, Davis is highlighting investments he's brought home to the district while surrogates speak to his influence in Washington. Unfortunately, in Congress, seniority matters. And so regardless of how many fresh ideas you have, it's, it's when you were elected. And so here right now, as the Democrats are on the verge of regaining the House, we have Danny Davis who sits on Ways and Means, which is a very important committee, as we've seen in the past. It's able to bring back money back to the state of Illinois. Tomorrow night, the 34th Ward Democratic Organization and Alderman Bill Conway are hosting a candidate forum. Davis, Conyers Irvin, and Kena Collins are all confirmed, Mike and Ray.